Life for me ain't been no crystal stat, it's had tax in it. Boards torn up places, but no carpet on the floor, bam. But all the time, I's been a climbing on and reaching landings and turning corners and sometimes going in the dark where there ain't been no light. So boy, don't you stop now. Don't you sit down on the steps cause you finds this kind of hard. But I still going, boy. I still climbing. And life for me ain't been no crystal star. Well, life for none of us has been a crystal star. But we must keep moving. We must keep going. Keep working. Keep striving. Never give up. Fall down seven times. Get up eight. Ease is a greater threat to progress than hardship. So keep moving, keep growing, keep learning. You keep standing. No matter how rough the sea, you keep standing. No matter what you don't give up, you keep standing. No matter what. If you can't fly, run. If you can't run, walk. If you can't walk, crawl. But by all means, keep moving. Life is about losing. As we get older, we lose our hair, we lose our teeth, we lose our mothers, our fathers, our sisters. And um, but it's the ones who overcome, they're lost in life and um, can shun away adversity and always willing to fight at every, every particular moment in life are the ones that are able to transcend and be able to spread the word to other people who's in that same particular genre as they are. Success has nothing to do with potential. It's all about the perseverance of somebody. That will override any endeavor. If you throw shit against the wall, eventually something will stick. You guys that are, have this potential, don't have this potential, you know, that shit dies. What continues to last forever is a perseverance to always show up. That's what champions do. Every single champion is the same as every ordinary person. The only differential is that they show up to the event every single day. It doesn't matter what you're born with, it doesn't matter your potential, how much you know, the silver spoon of money you have, all of that can be attained if you show up and you're willing to, to risk failure for success. Well, here's what I'm suggesting to you. That when you're working, you have a wall to break through. Let's say a friend of mine who walks, he runs a marathon, he says, he said, let's say that hypothetically, that 18th mile is the wall. He said, Les, when you get there and you're running, he says, everything in you is telling you to stop, to give up. Every muscle is aching. And you're saying to yourself, I can't do it. I can't do it. And you just keep on and you keep on and you keep on. It seems like you're moving at slow motion. And then eventually when you break through, that 18 mile wall, then you know it's like done and you're on automatic and you glide on in and you know it's there. You know you're gonna get to the finish line. And we've all had experiences where we were working on something and we knew it was possible and we did those things that were necessary to bring it into reality. We took the responsibility to make it happen. A lot of people couldn't see it. A lot of people didn't believe it. You were attacked, you were criticized. People were opposing you, but you kept on doing it. And it's going to be hard. Easy is not an option. But if it's hard, we will do it hard. Whatever is required to snatch victory from the jaws of defeat. And it's worth it, yes. It's worth whatever we have to do. And once we know that, it is done. It is done. It is done. It is done.